Good morning, everybody. It's coffee time with one tablespoon of the sugar-free pumpkin spice coffee creamer for one point. All right, so now I'm preparing my breakfast. So I'm going to do one full cup of cottage cheese. Uh, the kind I use is this one. Good culture. If you've never had it, it is amazing. I buy the lactose-free version so I don't get any bloating or gas. And here are the calories and the macros for you. As you can see by the container, it's so natural. There's nothing artificial in it. And that's why I love it so, so much. And the protein in it keeps me full for hours but I'm not gonna just leave it here. I have to add some things to it. So I'm gonna do two of these Wasa sourdough crisp bread crackers. This is what they look like and they're really good too and they keep you full as well. So I'm gonna plop two in there and this meal would not be complete without some veggies. So I have a couple of little grape tomatoes and some cucumbers. This entire meal will keep you full for hours and I'm gonna show you the points value right here. So five points for the cottage cheese and one for the crackers. It is cold this morning. Walking the doggies, getting in some vitamin D. I love the fresh air. All right, so I'm packing up my lunch and then I'm heading out to work, but I wanted to show you what I'm packing. I made a giant salad. Basically in this bowl is a ton of lettuce, all different color peppers, cucumbers, yellow onion, and I have chicken sausage. So on top of all of that, I'm going to be adding this. This is the G Hughes sugar-free vinaigrette, which I love. One tablespoon is one point. I used two of the roasted red pepper and Asiago chicken sausages. Two of these is seven points. One is three. So I had two for seven points. So making my total lunch 10 points, as you can see, which is fine with me because we're going to have a nice light dinner. All right, home from work, time to make a snack with these ingredients. I'm going to take a tablespoon of Greek yogurt on each rice cake, and I'm going to top it with some fresh apple and some fat-free whipped cream that I just showed you. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna sprinkle it with some cinnamon and I'm gonna enjoy this little snack. So again, I have two rice cakes, which are equal to four points. The yogurt is zero, the apple is zero, the whipped cream is zero, and the cinnamon is zero. So for four points, this is such a good snack. It's like having a little apple pie or some kind of autumn type snack. You could put on pumpkin pie spice if you want. I just chose cinnamon because it balanced out the caramel in the rice cakes. So here I'm gonna show you a picture of what the app says, four points for this beautiful snack. I'm gonna have this, I'm gonna start dinner now. I'm gonna go change out of my work clothes and I'll see you at dinner. All right guys, turkey meatloaf. The red on top is not raw meat, it's ketchup, sugar-free ketchup. So I mixed one egg, a little bit of breadcrumbs in there to make the meatloaf, and I have some baby red potatoes cooking with a little bit of oil and garlic, onion, salt, and pepper. This is dinner. It's about three ounces of turkey meatloaf and some potatoes. I'm choosing not to make a veggie other than the potatoes because that salad I had today was just astronomical. This is all I can handle for one day. I'm absolutely stuffed. So I hope you enjoyed this day of eating with me. At the end of this, I will show you the point value for my dinner and you'll be able to see exactly what I had for the full day. So if you like this kind of video, please subscribe, give it a thumbs up and add a comment below. If you followed me throughout the end of this video, leave a heart in the comment section so I know you did. There's the points value and I'll see you tomorrow.